Welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure. You're probably wondering what all this burning is in the background, right? Did you do this? Uh, well, we're gonna find out. No, oh, that's that's not a good thing. Everybody is dead in my sonic cannon! You know, I was thinking of writing a fan fiction exactly like this, except nobody lives. Oh, I can't have that, though. That's way too dark. Why? I'm a master of grim dark. Why did this have to happen? Won't somebody think of the chows? It's terrible. She just saw Sonic 06. <laughs> I've seen your future, now. Sonic. It's not that bright. Bam, bam! We're gonna be occasionally coming back to this, uh, past part or whatever. But if you didn't notice, that puffball took us back to the past, and, uh, <gasps> she had the same voice as the puffball, too. <gasps> Are you well, saying... We're gonna be, uh... Uh, what was that all about? We'll be, we'll be uh, clarifying that I'm later on here. here. Oh, okay. Hmm? But in the meantime, there's Eggman! Eggman. Where's that sneaky bastard off to? <laughs> What's he doing here? Well, never mind. This time I'll get him good. We are <gasps> gonna get him good because this is the last stage that Sonic will be doing. Yes, we are what? reaching the ending of Sonic's part of the game. Oh my gosh, you're kidding me. I'm not kidding you. Wow, that's... Oh. Oh. We need to make sure that Eggman is safely hidden. It is secret base that nobody can see. You know, except for the uh, the strobe lights going on in the back. Not strobe lights. Oh my god, search lights. <laughs> oh my gosh, the Eggman, the Eggman dance party happening right now. Hey, it's Metal Sonic. Look at that. Whoa. Huh. Is this? Believe it, believe it or not, we have made our way back to the egg carrier. No way. The, the grounded egg carrier, mind. Uh, another Metal Sonic? Yeah, I guess he's mass-producing them now. And I just... Well, I mean... <laughs> I wound up on the... Oh, no. <laughs> I'm just thinking Oops. one Metal Sonic wasn't able to do the job. Why not make tons of them? Make it an army, yeah. Alright. Oh, so God, that's actually terrifying. Just, just think how many Metal Sonics could make terrible games. Ah. Uh. Hmm. All right, now uh, what we gotta do here is we gotta turn all these lights and. <gasps> I'm sorry, I'm terrible at these. I'm, I I'm love just, these. I'm just the worst at this shit. I love these puzzles. Let me do it. Eh. Eh. No. I'll gotta figure something out here. No. No. Uh, no. Okay. You you good, press good, that good, one. Good. Good. No. Good. no, no. Uh, okay. uh, wait. No. Uh. All right. Uh. There. Um. Dude, you're killing okay. me here. Okay. Okay. I they oh, no, they go in right. threes. There, okay. All right. Oh wait. All right. No. Oh, wait. I got it now. And boom. There you go. I like to mention, it doesn't stay that way too. <laughs> Fooled you. <laughs> so there you go. And now we're at the last level, which is called Final Egg. Aw. That would have been a nice like callback if they called it like Flying Battery or something, because I really like that. That stage's name. This is the new Sonic at the time. Time okay. for callback. <laughs> this is Sonic's final level and probably the most challenging level. Uh, yeah, no kidding. Good lord. I say challenging. I don't mean difficult per se. It, it, it's it's challenging. It's a, it's a nice level. I like this a lot better than the Aquatic Base in Sonic 06 or whatever the fuck it was called. Well, that those were just asinine. This what? Oh my god! How are you supposed to get through that? I think you're supposed to do the ancient light to take care of it, but fuck it, I got this. I got shit <laughs> to do. That's what I'm thinking. At this point in the game, do you really have to, you know, worry about special abilities or anything like that? Not really. I mean, they throw a couple of things your way, but if, if you've been doing fine these past few stages, then you should be fine with this one, too. I mean, oh, except when you get stunlocked into oh, death. Oh, uh, damn. That is just uh. Uh, spectacular to see. Hmm. Oh man! All right, here we go. Let's try it again. Not gotta love video game stun locks. 
Oh, yeah. Glad that went away with uh, Galaxy 2. Haven't seen much of that since. Mm hmm. You know, yeah, one thing a... I. Go ahead. No, I, I lost it. <laughs> It'll come back. Well, I was saying that uh, this is a particularly long level, too. It's got several stages to it. This is the first of, I believe, three. And now we're at the second. Oh, now, now I remember. I noticed uh, Sonic Adventure, it it didn't start the, uh, what I like to call the bullshit pits that newer Sonic games do. Like, most of the time in a hard ah. stage, it's not the obstacles, it's the fact that you fall into a pit you couldn't see. Yeah. Like I said, this has better level design than many of the other Sonic games that came after this. And it doesn't seem that hard. It's clear. Like, like this is... Yeah. yeah. Oh, it'll get hard, but uh, it's clear. It has conveyance. I can see what needs to be done and where I'm going. You know. Well, well. Okay. <laughs> 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 uh -huh. mm. Anyway. Ahem. No, I'm just saying. Like, artificial difficulty is not fun. And when you just throw somebody into a bottomless pit that you couldn't see, that's bullshit. This has considerably less of that, though. Ooh. I know, that's why I'm saying it's good. I see that over there. I see it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get no, that not. thing. Yeah, I am. I'm gonna get oh, that I... thing. Here we go. No, 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 no. One. <laughs> and... Oh, there we go. Already got it. Uh... Oh, cool. What? That's all you need. Okay. All right, now getting back over there is the other tricky part. Okay. Okay, good. Got it. All right. You're a Sonic Master. Yeah, don't don't even try. No, no, no. <laughs> I'm nowhere hey, near you got a Sonic lot farther Master. than me. You've actually beaten this game. <laughs> I've actually beaten a Sonic game. Ha ha ha. Yeah, I'm. I, I hate this game because I can't beat it. It's too old for me. I'm sorry. I'm sure some people may say that I defend this game too much, and that's not true. This game does have a lot of issues. A lot <laughs> of problems. But no, I'm saying for it's still back fun. in the Dreamcast days, this is fine. Oh yeah. All right, now we've reached the uh, next leg of this part. This is the longest part of the game of the level, I think. And it's full of bullshit. <laughs> Giant pendulum hammers. Yeah, you think it was easy jumping from one platform to another, and now let's see what happens when you have this shit in the way. Ah! See ya! Oh man, if I die again, I'm gonna have to do everything all over. And, well, uh -oh. there you go! Alright! No. Welcome to our first game over of the Let's Play! Excellent! Oh, that's it. Very excellent. And it takes you back to the beginning of the stage, so guess what? We're gonna go ahead and crossfade into where I'm actually succeeding. Alright. So let's try that again. Once more. Oh, you didn't go with my theory that if Sonic gets a game over, you'd start at the very beginning. Like, of the game. Oh, he did. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> but uh, part of the problem is that uh, right after I did the last level, I went right onto this one. Which means I still had, like, one life left, so <laughs> I don't have my usual plethora of extra lives Ooh. like I normally do. Ooh, that was a good yeah. save. Yeah! Skill! Yeah, yeah, sure, we'll call it that. Yeah, yeah. And, oh, it's an elevator that takes us down to... Oh, you were right there, uh, too. That, that sucks. Oh, well, there we go. I wasn't right there. We still more of the level. Oh, well... Way okay. more. It looks like it was transitioning into part three. No, not yet. This is just more uh, vertical jumping. Oh, oh wow! Have you ever had that feeling in a game where you just look down and you see everything below you and you... Well, me being afraid of heights, sometimes you just can't do that jump. It is... It does get dizzying. <laughs> it's like you're playing Grand Theft Auto V and you jump out of a plane. <laughs> yeah. This is a weird elevator. Oh. That's terrifying. But this is the third part. Thank you for riding with Air Spider. 
get out. Uh, that's half a spider. It's got four legs. <laughs> oh, fine. Oh, right in the face. There's two lives there I want to get. No, that was a shield, my bad. But that's a life. Excuse me, one life? Oh, there we go. Another life! Where were these earlier? <laughs> and now we get the Geodude room. Dude. 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 The thing about, the thing about them is that they uh, explode, like, really, really hugely. And it hurts. So, yeah, like that. Jeez. So the idea is you gotta figure out where to go and just, or destroy all of them first. So you have enough room to breathe. Now, do they blow each oh. other up? I, I don't know. I don't think they do. I was about to say, couldn't you technically get them all in one area, blow up one, and then cause a chain reaction? I see an extra life or something down there, but I think we got enough now. I'm not going to go for it. Good. I was about to say earlier, uh, the architect that made this, if Eggman actually hired somebody and said, make the egg carrier the most impossible thing to navigate and have it done by Friday, thank you. Why do you think he uh, goes around in that uh, little egg hover thing all the time? <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa! That was awesome! The homing attack doesn't always uh, work as advertised, but 99% of the time. I thought you were just hanging on to one of those uh, robot's propellers. Oh, no. Another Geodude room. Nah, these look more like gravelers. Really? I don't see it. I don't know, maybe they're golems. Oh. I don't know. They don't have legs, they're Geodudes, I swear. Ah! <laughs> Here, let's go really obscure. Those, those are nose passes. <laughs> Stupid Easter Island looking Pokemon motherfucker. Uh, Stupid new Pokemon. <laughs> Everything past Generation 1 sucks. No, no, just past Generation 3. <laughs> And then another one up. Why can this Fennekin dr drive a plane? What is wrong with you, Sonic Universe? <coughs> All right. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, that might have uh, that might have gone over a few people's heads. Uh, well, I don't That's know. That's right, though. Is Tails actually a Firefox? Uh, I don't. I don't think he is. He looks more like a Linux user. Oh, uh, well, think, uh, yeah, I could see I, I th that. I think he might have coded his own browser, you know what I'm saying? Uh, well, he is smart enough. Dude, you're going to love Tails' story. Am I? This may not be the best game that Sonic has been in, but it's certainly the best that Tails has been in. <laughs> oh, we'll, have, we'll have fun. <laughs> that laugh of yours. Hey, let go! I, I'm, I can only imagine what's going to happen in Tails' story. <laughs> oh, no! Hey! Hey! I got little dolls of us! They're dead! This will come in, This will come into play way later on. They're, they're not there just for nothing, okay? Really? Yeah, they're not there just for nothing. They do serve a minor purpose. I shall include them in Sonic R! This is more terrifying than chaos! Lightspeed dash, and there you go, and yes. we're at the end! Oh, cool. That's it. That was Sonic's final level. This better have an amazing payoff, I must say. Well, you're yeah, just gonna have to bad. keep watching and find out. This isn't one of, gonna be one of those, like, to-be-continued kind of things, right? No, 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 no. Really? Really? Okay. I would not. I would not like this game so much if it had a fucking cliffhanger bullshit. So Sonic's gonna run in, defeat the bad guy, and the day is saved. Essentially, but first we gotta do the thing of beating the bad guy first. Oh, boss time. Okay. Yeah. But and he stuck it. Well, that was impossible, but hey, we'll run with it. Well, if it isn't hey, hey, house, Uggy boy. Yeah, I'm surprised too. Yeah, I think we all are. <laughs> like, every time a villain says that, I want them to actually sound surprised. It's like, I'm actually... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm surprised you, uh, you made it. Wow, 
I mean, wow. I mean, I couldn't even pass that. How did you make it? I took the shortcut. It takes me an hour to get past there. It only takes you ten minutes. Are you serious? Oh, I... So final boss time. Here we go. Egg Viper. Uh huh. That's a really short Viper. This, this is a difficult boss if you don't know everything about it already, <laughs> which I do. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. That that timing was just perfect. I know everything about this boss gets blasted in the face. <laughs> See if you can make it through here. What the hell is he doing? Oh, okay. He's taunting me, I think. Oh. It sounded like he was. He, well, it didn't sound it. He just looked like he was pulling a Tasmanian devil. So, really, gotta time what he says with what he's doing. Like, you know, get a load of jump and then you'll be fine. He's got that thing, too. You know, it's. He, he's not particularly challenging, especially here. Are you serious? He's charging up a laser when he does that, though, so there is a bit of a time limit. Oh, okay. <laughs> Except he does that about every single time, and he doesn't do a very good job get of charging the laser. I, I was just thinking, he's like, Come and get me, I dare you! <laughs> so he has a few, uh, a plethora of moves that are very easily countered or avoided. And he doesn't recognize patterns that well. Yeah, I noticed that. Uh, Eggman, you might want to change up your strategy just a bit. Oh, see, like that. Change it up like I do, that. I do want to give him credit, though. Like, the the small credit I can, I can give him. He is very relentless. Yeah? Oh, jeez. Yeah, he's got a lot of moves, though. That they're just very easy to counter. Now, will the platforms eventually go away? Uh, yeah. Maybe. I'll just do that laugh you like so much. <laughs> I know something you don't know. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Woo! Hey, Eggman. Oh! I love how blown away he is by that. No way! I can't believe this! Well, I think it goes back to the fact that. Oh, shit! <laughs> yeah, he's not fucking around. Okay. He is relentless. Oh! Wow! He really wants you dead! <laughs> it's no use. Give up. <laughs> See, look, the utter shock and terror that Eggman <laughs> feels right now. <laughs> Alright, one more hit. What's he gonna do now? Destroy everything. Oh, no. Get away with it? <laughs> like, it's why no doesn't he just do that? Just no. Destroy everything. You don't need the floor. Sonic does. Alright, boss is over. Oh, wait. Dodge it. Watch out. He's up to something. Yeah. What's he, he gonna do? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Up wow. and boom! Wow. Now he's gone. Oh, that is a cheap shot. That was great. I, hey, I love that. Play you some other time. Hey, well, yeah, I'm not complaining. That was awesome. That's like something Dark Souls would do. Instead of the, uh, the boss ending, he would like do one last death throw and speed. Ninja Gaiden 2 did it too. Uh, don't all of them do that anyway in Dark Souls? No. Oh, well, uh, you, all right. Usually, usually once you butt stab them the hundredth time, they end up going down forever. Sometimes. Usually. And then they return. Oh, he's fine. I don't know how he wound up here, but here we are. <laughs> uh, okay, sure, whatever. He's alive and well. Everybody lives. The day is saved thanks to Sonic the Hedgehog. Ta -da. And uh, we get a, a nice reprise of Sonic's theme called It Doesn't Matter. Well, when it came to the sales figures of this game. Well, probably not, because it didn't matter. Yeah, because it, it sold billions anyway, so hey. You just destroyed the cameraman! Ah, he's fine. Everybody's fine! I gotta wonder, what is he saying here? I thought he it's was like, singing the yep. lyrics. It's like, yep, and after I uh, scalped Eggman, I sent him off in his ship to go off and cry. I'm the hero! So now it's credits. Answer me this. this. 
Yeah, that, yeah, go ahead. That last I fight... I, 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 I want to hear your thoughts on Sonic's leg of the story. I want to take this time to just sort of, uh... Sort of really sit back, reflect on the past 12 episodes. Well, just answer me this first before we go any sure. further with that. Uh, Chaos, that last fight we had with him when he had the six Chaos Emeralds, that was it? Mm -hmm. There, there was no, like, alternate, like, form or death rattle or something like that. <laughs> this game is bullshit. <laughs> we'll... Just, uh... Yeah, I, I, Let's put Chaos on the back burner for now. Yeah, just, I, just, I'm assuming... <laughs> I'm assuming with a game like this and so many stories, the final, final boss happens when you beat everybody's story. Am I right about that? Of course. Of course. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. You can't just beat Sonic's game and then say, Well, there's five more, but fuck it, I got the credits, I'm done! Nah, it doesn't work that way. Alright, so if you want the true, true ending, you gotta beat it with everybody. Just like how it has been with every other Sonic game since these. Oh, why'd you have to remind me? Well, most of the newer Sonic games just stick with the main character. As far as what I thought, Sonic has the best levels, I'm, a, I'm guessing. He does have the levels that shine, but and usually with everyone else, they're just not as good. And that that is kind of true, but you can still have a lot of fun with everybody else. There are There's still a lot of really good game to be had. It's not like we got through the best part of it, now everything else is crap. There's still a lot of really good parts to go through. So, the fun's not over yet. Nowhere near... Nowhere near over to being fun being over yet so so what would you rather have a fun game or a good story why can't i have both oh i mean you can have both but i'm just throwing this out there because uh this uh story like, and how if, it was presented I... is just kind of overall silly to me like i can't take this seriously at all well the story is not really meant to be as prominent as it was in other sonic games it just meant there to be as a framing device for all the fun action levels and all that the story gets really better by Sonic Adventure 2 because it actually has some duality to it and it has nuances and all that, and all that shit. But uh, everything after that, you don't really have to worry about it too much. Okay, but, okay. Uh, the, the, the Adventure series has the best, most complex, and actually plausible story. Gotcha. These are the two best Sonic uh, 3D Sonic games that isn't generations. Uh, to be fair, Sonic's never been one for a good story. You just kind of yeah. run fast. He, he can be. He can have a good story if he, if the writers actually tried. But instead, they're too busy on trying to reinvent the wheel, and instead of you know, polishing and fixing what they have, they just throw new ideas on top of what they, what they have and come up with something completely different and not anywhere near as good. <laughs> you have a bunch of Japanese developers in a boardroom saying, Why can't we beat Mario? What is he doing that we're doing wrong? We need another fucking reboot! It, oh, hold on. Bandages! Put them on those stupid woodland animals. Let's God, see them yes, run around. Yes. Bandages! Let's get rid of the paper cut that was Sonic 06 by putting a band-aid over it! I'm just wondering, like, as soon as Sonic started talking, they're like, now the possibilities are endless, and then it just went straight downhill. <laughs> Except for colors and generations. Those are great. Man. And apparently Lost Man. Worlds. Apparently Lost Worlds is decent. Because it's I Sonic Galaxy. I haven't played it. I haven't played it. I have no nothing. I have nothing in that game. <laughs> I have no, I I have no willing will and fullness to play it. <laughs> yeah, but yeah. Mario Sunshine. Right. Wait a minute. Well, that's... Oh, Ooh. I see what you did there. <laughs> Somebody stole an idea somewhere. And with our fourteenth emblem, more fun next time on Sonic Adventure.